Let's do this! Welcome to KPE Paranormal Urbex. Tonight, we bring you all here to this mushroom mine here in Olive Hill, Kentucky. We are going to take you all along inside to see what it looks like in there to see if we can capture any paranormal evidence here at this location. This location has reported of bodies found inside the mines. There was a kidnapping that went down here. I believe it was by the name of Stephanie who kidnapped the two people and there was a murder in this cave here that's right behind me and it's rumored to be haunted so y'all definitely keep your eyes out let us know if y'all hear anything and let's get started make sure to smash the like button and share this video out, and y'all come with let's do this what happened in this cave is that in February of 2004 two bodies were discovered around a quarter mile inside the mine which is right behind me they were the bodies of a married couple who had been reported missing about a month earlier. The son and his girlfriend were charged with murder. So the son and the girlfriend killed the uh... His mom and dad. Mom and dad. So that's interesting there. And we got a car right there. As you've seen. I'm gonna keep that in there. The son and the girlfriend is the one that murdered the married couple and stashed them inside this mine here of a mushroom mine. And we are here tonight to get some answers of why the son, his girlfriend, did all that to the married couple. There were reports of people hearing miners working. I'm not sure if y'all heard that. Right after I was just now mentioning about it. Did you hear that? Yeah. That was strange. Alrighty. Reporter of hearing miners working. Alright. The overpowering sound of rushing water where there is no water. Seeing robbed figures. Hearing voices far away in the tunnels. And feeling a presence that they can't explain. Now. As I was just mentioning about like a residual haunting of the miners that was working on this mine working, there's a loud tap, kind of like an axe or something, whatever pick they hats. use. Pickaxe. what? A pickaxe. A pickaxe. To whatever they use to work on the mines, like kind of like that, that's probably like a residual haunting of what I just captured on camera while doing the intro. So this night is definitely going to be interesting, y'all, to say the least. I'll say let's rock and roll. Thank you, spirits, for making yourself known already to us. We come in peace. We, may, we mean no harm, no disrespect. We want to get answers of why the son and his girlfriend murdered the married couple. Money was probably involved. Possibly money was probably involved. Right now, what I'm doing is I am undoing the tripod. By raising up the legs. It's a 136 acre limestone mine. We're making our way into the cave. Hello? Hello? 
Hello? As soon as we walked in, I heard a noise. A female? Yeah. Oh, that too. Can you make yourselves known to us, please? Did you say something? I heard no. So you did not say nothing? No. I heard, could you make yourselves known to us, please? And I heard no. Very clear. And that was a female. Ma'am, were you the one that got murdered by the son and his girlfriend? I just heard you say no to me. What I ask, can you show yourself? It was the son's fault. I heard the male saying it was his fault, which meaning the son's fault. We want to get answers. I got chills. You that? We got equipment out. And we're going to bring out even more equipment, too. I know they are making noise when they touch the shuttle. So that is the entry where we came in from. So right off the bat, I already heard voices and may have already figured out the answer so far that it was the son's fault. Like the son planned it and his girlfriend helped him out of murdering the married couple. Is that true? Did the son already got it planned it out? You can speak to me. Yes, he did. It was very faint. It was a female. We are so sorry that he did it to, to you. His own parents. Y'all believe it could be money involved why he did it? There's a voice right there. Let's ask that question again. I believe we heard you, ma'am or sir, but could you say it again? Would you believe that uh, it could be money involved that they murdered you? Was the money involved? I believe I heard a deep growl of a no. Was it something else? Yes. Did you hear that? Mm -mm. It's to my left. Again, do not be scared. We are here to communicate with y'all. We come with, with respect and peace. We are experienced investigators. 
If you're stuck, we could possibly help y'all cross over. Do you want to be crossed over? Did you hear that? Mm-hmm. Or no? Do y'all want to be crossed over? Do you like the mushroom mine? Yes, I do. So they do not want to be crossed over. They just love this place here. I mean, I would too, but I don't want to be murdered and stored in the mushroom mines. I want to be buried respectfully and all that stuff. Even if I did get murdered or whatnot, but I still do not want that to happen. And that was me. Right, that was Joey. If you heard that. The bottle. Somewhere. Right. Where well, it was. Bottle. Are you sure that was you then? Cause this is a can. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. The fireball. But uh. Yeah. To go back to what I was saying. Um. I would not want to be murdered and stored in a mine like this. However, as a spirit, I would not mind being attached to this mushroom mine. It'd be cool. They probably walk like to the morning or night night jog in here. That's probably why they love it here. Uh huh. Yeah, we got no service at all. Can he throw something? Like a rock? You said something? Mm -hmm. Thank you if that was you. Can you make a louder sound? There's definitely a lot of voices. Look at this, y'all. If I do go live, I'm going to have to go from the outside of the mine just to get connection. There is um, rooms and storage. But as soon as we walked in, we already may have gotten our answers of why the son and his girlfriend did what they did to the married couple. It was planned out by the son has nothing to do with money. Was it had to do with something about arguments? Reason why the son and the daughter killed you? Was the argument involved? Is that the reason why? You can tell me, it's okay. Was it the argument that drew them to kill y'all? I may have heard a faint yes. I want to. I see an apparition down there. I'm not sure if the camera's picking up. Is that you walking? Ooh, there's a noise back there after I said that. It's okay, I'm not scared.
My camera's probably picking y'all up. I'm going to turn on something, okay? It's called a necrometer. I want you to manipulate the app. Has a dictionary of words, and I want you to say a word that matches your story. It's very cool to use. We are lost souls. Y'all are lost souls? So right off the bat, we are lost souls. Something good is going to happen. Something bad is going to happen. Oh, something good is going to happen. Yeah, because the answers are going to be, you know, I'm saying recorded. And it's going to... Ruth. Your answers are going to be recorded of why the murder happened. And it's going to be spread over around the world. That's a good thing that's going to happen. Well, 10.52. We arrived close to around like 10. Mm -hmm. Well, could it have happened at 10? Possibly. Did a murder happen at 10 a.m. in the morning? Ooh, I heard a yes. It's to my left. Yeah, I'm not going to go with it. Flub it. We're going to stay on this path here. Also, that way we won't get lost. Jailhouse. Jailhouse. Is he walking in the jail? And the male, which is the son, is still in prison, I believe. Good. I hope he walked in there. And the, uh, his girlfriend's... Information. Information. Jailhouse. Correct. Correct. Information. So he is walking in prison. And, uh, his girlfriend is released. Seen an orb flew by and I heard a noise. I'm getting chills all over my body. Can you make the loudest noise you can make? <coughs> Cut that part out. Ma'am and sir, can you pinpoint me the direction to where the uh, buildings are at? You said something? Mm -mm. You said to the right? Thank you. Whoa, what did it say? Enter. Look by the exit. Look by the exit. Look, look by the exit, fail. You want to hold it? So I'll keep getting it out of my pocket. Thank you. So the spirit 
said, that's what I'm saying. The spirit said, right. The spirit said, right, to where I asked to pinpoint us the direction to the rooms and the buildings. And we went right, and that's when my eye saw the buildings. That was cool. But right off the bat, we got like an answer of why they got murdered. The female spoke right away. Sneeze. Sneeze. This one, that one, please. And this kind of dusty in here, too. You want to keep going this way? Uh huh. Could a bad energy cause them to do it? There's a voice back there. What was the question you asked? Could a bat and she did it. Did what? Made him do it. Made the son do all do all that to his parents. I heard uh yeah, it did. Now I was like trying to refrain of what the question you were asking. So something drove him mad in here. Look at the ceilings. Probably not. Probably not. Not drove him mad. But, uh, that energy may have forced him to do it. See, some uh, got toasty down here. Uh -huh. Three people did. Or four. Yep. Take a picture. Um, couple. One in heel. One in heel. Delay. Delay. Alright, so when I was trying to take a picture for a thumbnail, um, still had an echo meter going and we got a Plus. response saying 2000s. And in 2004, the body was found in here than a month earlier. You know what I'm saying? So that was pretty interesting there. Did a bus used to come over here? Because it, it just said bus. What did it say? Bus. We got car bus right here. And it picking it up.
Before we set up down any more equipment, we want to see if we could set off these cap balls. I want to turn off the light. It's got to be complete darkness. Albert. Albert. Spirits, can you come forward and set off those cat balls, please? Anyone that you two walk in the mine, or the two couples, or anyone, can you please touch the cat balls, please? And it's like complete darkness in here. Don't be afraid. I'm going to look around. I'm going to try something. Yes, we know you two were murdered. I'm starting to get a headache. But that's what's in now. Did you get shot? Did you get shot in the head by like a silencer, like a silencer pistol? Cause I'm feeling like a head pain. Now it just went away. I'm gonna get the K2 out. That should be easy for you all to use. So the K2 meter will be easier for you to use in this sold. Follow us. Definitely. And follow us. Whisks. Is it voices? Huh? Is it voices? It says wisps. Alrighty. Um, just send that on your phone. What? A video thing is saying something. I think we yeah, fast enough. That's weird. So another exercise. Now another piece of evidence that we just captured is that stuff on my phone was messing up.
you come to it, you may it be. You will not do it? They probably don't got much of energy. Huh? They probably don't got much of energy. Energy. Build your energy. Set off these devices for us. We've already heard your voices. Wanna try something? Bruise. Bruise. Kappa, as soon as I said that, Kappa. Look at that, Kappa communication. And it just said path. Are you walking in the path now? Do that again if that was you. Thank you for that. Alrighty, so we did get the uh, cap all to go off now. Right after, so we did not get no cap all communication. Can you say it off again? I know it had to take a lot of energy, and I did tell you to build up your energy. Thank you, appreciate that. It's pretty cool, huh? All right, since we now know how to use that, which is great, it'll definitely help us get some answers from y'all up to why the murder happened. Can you step away from it, please? Let's set it off again. Step away from it. Pull your energy away from it. Can you send it out to purple? This is how you send it out to purple. Place your finger on the platform. There you go. Can you do that for us? There's an orb. That flew right by the REM pod. So it's trying to build an energy right now to do it. 
Feel free any time to set off that cap ball again. There's another orb coming in. Curve in. Two. two orbs. There's two spirits in this room right now. It was curving over to the front of the camera. Madison. Madison. Did you used to work here, Madison? Capo. So that I take that Peter. as Peter. So I take that as a yes. Peter, you worked here as well? Peter, if you worked here as well, can you set off the cat ball, please? Ooh, wow. Thank you. See the cat ball, y'all? So Madison and Peter both worked here. And I just mentioned about two spirits, and I saw the two orbs. Are those your orbs? Can you set up the cop off it is? Sit off those cat balls right there if that was your orb, two of them. I know I had to take a lot of energy. I saw something glided right over there. You got, thank you. So those were the two orbs of Peter and Madison. It seems like I don't want to come in here. It's okay to come in here. We're friendly. I promise you. Use the energy to light the sickness. Sickness. Use, the, use your energy to light up the red pod. We, we want to see purple. Thank you. Thank you for the cat pod, but we want to see the red pod now. We know you could do it. It is flashing on the red pod. Yeah, it's picking it up. You're doing a great job. You can do it purple. I want to sing you a song. Light it up to purple, purple, purple. Light it up to purple for us, please. You can do it. You got the Scratch. End. Scratch. Oh, you don't like me singing. Oh, wow. Uh, do not scratch me, please. Holy crap, the video lights died. It's on zero bars. Did you drain my video light? It was at three when we came. It did. It drained my video light. It was fully charged even if it was at three. Mm -hmm. It was still fully charged. And it was just responded to, yes, it was. Using the um, video light for energy. That's why the cat ball's going off now. We need the light. <laughs> I got backup, but do not drain the backup, please. Well, let me try singing that song again. Purple, purple, can you light up the purple? Purple, purple, I know you got the energy. Purple, purple, you can do it. I know you can, cause you are the greatest. Purple, purple, don't let no one stop you. Purple, purple, use your energy. Purple, purple, light up that red pot. You know how to make it beep. Now place your finger on the red platform. Purple, purple, we want to see purple. Purple, purple, we want to see purple. I think I scared it away. Sorry if I scared you with my singing. <laughs> that the first time you scared something away. Sorry if I scared you with my singing. Can you come back, please? 
I was trying to help you. Kayla. Kayla. Felt a breeze past my leg. Kayla, can you set off the cat ball? You've seen Peter and Madison do it. Kayla, can you set off the cat ball? For some reason, I'm feeling a burning pain on my knee. On your knee? Burning pain? And it says scratch. All right, try to harm Joey. The nothing like does help. I felt like, you know, my, my knee was being Hold on. born. Like right here, where I was standing, it felt something Show your knee. born on it. Show your knee. It may st oh, wow, as soon as I was pointing the camera on your knee. Hold on now. Did you throw something? No. You heard something got thrown? Yeah, I got, I, I've been like, in this I will win. I will win, holy crap. No, you won't. Look Wait. at that. That like way he'll feel had a born in pain. Oh wow. You cannot hurt us. You will not win if there's an evil entity in here. I could promise you that. If the murder was planned for the married couple from the son and his girlfriend, can you set off the cat ball? Already. That was planned. And in the very beginning of the video, if you hear... Upsurging. Upsurging. And uh, if you hear the voice from the very beginning of the video, it said, yes, like the one of the spirits said, yes, it was planned, okay? Again, no negative, en no negative energies, no negative entities may hurt us. 11. What was that? You pat pat fell. I just told you no negative energies and no negative entities may hurt us. And it's at 11. Cap all again. Right after the backpack fell. And it's 11.23. We got one other question. Okay, thank you. Was the murder due to an argument? Set off the cap off it is. Or if it was due to an argument. I gave you about 15 seconds because I know that I had to take a lot of energy. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So it's not from an argument. Was the murder involved by a money issue? Set off the cat ball if yes. Because we want to know why the murder happened. Nightmare. Nightmare. Cheryl. Cheryl. What's their argument between Cheryl with the son and the girlfriend? And then they got involved with you all?
We need to know this. I watch you manipulate this app. Ara. A U R A. Ara. I watch you manipulate this app. Tell us the answer, please, to why the son and the girlfriend murdered you. Give us the answer. I heard revenge. There's footsteps. You cannot scare us out of here. Usually when silence is happening, it's not a, usually a good idea or a good thing. Gentlemanly. Gentlemanly. Camera's focusing, and there was an orbit that flew by. I believe it was probably due to an argument. And maybe money was involved with it. Like they were trying to get some property taken over by them in her name, but they said no and whatnot. And the son got mad and had his girlfriend help him with the murder of the married couple. I seen something flew right past the camera real fast. There's a whole lot of shadow figures right now. There was just one of them right in front of the flashlight too. I don't know the camera how to pick it up. It was like a back splash of a uh, shadow figure like right there. Well, we thank you for communicating with us and letting us get some answers. We appreciate it. But I think it's best time for us to go. Um, I don't feel safe staying here any longer since, of course, Joey, now, he had like a burning sensation in his left leg or right leg, whichever leg it was. Yes. And you see some of the marks that may cause that burning sensation. And if we recall from the necrometer, it says scratch. And also idle when that's sort of two responses and that's when we felt that burning sensation. Um, we did get cat ball communication, some red pot activity, not so much so, you know, hate to hear. But in the very, very beginning, we had tons and tons of voices coming through from the spirits that low. No equipment was needed. I was able to hear them very clearly. And I know some of our subscribers can also hear the voices too, like Angel Heart and Triple X Lady. Now, they'll definitely hear the voices in the very beginning because it's really clear to me to be able to have me make that vo voices out of what they said. But we definitely got some answers here tonight at the Mushroom Runs. In my opinion, my theory of this investigation of what we accomplished here tonight it was planned out by the son, and the son needed help. So, the girlfriend decided to help the son. It's kind of communication, I was talking about that. 
And so they kidnapped, like the not the daughter, but uh, the girlfriend helped the kidnapped, which is Stephanie. The and kid. then the son did a murder. But the girlfriend took the married couple to this mushroom vine and murdered them. Now, it could have been with a silencer pistol to the head, possibly, because I felt like a head pain, like a head trauma, or something else, or they could have been whacked with an axe, or something like that, or pick's axe, because we did heard that noise of a thud or a bang and whatnot out of the front entrance, so that could have been theory, too. So, two of those options, like a silencer pistol or whacked in the head with the axe or something like that. Were there very couple whacked in the head? They weren't this up at all. So I was just remembering that too for the front entrance. That could have been a residual lighting. But of course, I also people working on the lines, that could be residual lighting too. But those were the two theories. Um, it was just a sad story that came upon, and we may have figured out it could possibly do to deal with money situation or they had a property attached to their name and the son and the daughter were trying to get that in their name when the married couple said no and they got mad and then so and so and so got it all planned which is the son and the daughter not the daughter but the uh, girlfriend of the son helped it together the kidnapping and it all collects into this case of the story. Um it could be some backup information as well possibly but that's just like part of the information that we have collected together in tonight's investigation um you don't know you know what y'all think about this investigation kind of mushroom runs we try to go live uh, we're going to try to go live outside in front of the mushroom runs i believe we could do that but in here it's just no signal whatsoever um Oh, one thing I would like to point out. When I asked, can you point, like pinpoint me to the direction of the room, so you know, the building where we're still in, standing in at, right? They said, yeah. And then he said it was Mel Spirit, go right. So it went right. And my eyeballs saw the rooms. So that was really cool. So they did have energy, but they took a while for them to use the audience equipment. But yeah, we did a great job investigating this place. Hope y'all like it, smash the like button, share this out, because this is really, really great evidence that we got tonight. I mean, we, I think we did a great job here tonight. I really do. Anyways, smash the like button, share this video out. KPE Paranormal Urbex, love and peace. Alright, so I want to keep a little bit while I gather the equipment. You never know, you may hear some voices in between us picking up the equipment and stuff like that. And also, I was also going to point out, we may have gotten a rocket for that Joey. We heard a noise pulling up to the mine. It was kind of like, I don't think it was a motorcycle. We will put that in the video as well. Um, but it was weird. It was ominous. It was very strange. Huh? I thought I was screaming while you were talking. Can you scream again? You probably have to replay that back. Can you scream? Scare us out of here, please. 
You cannot follow us home. You gotta stay here, please. All the good energy, all the bad energy, you have to stay here. Did it will you belong? You cannot attach yourself to any of our stuff or our vehicle. You must stay put right here. In this case, the mind. There's no disrespect in, in that. You should have to stay here. That it will you belong until you cross over. Because Judgment Day will come and God will choose your path. Judgment Day will come and God will choose your path. I know you do not want to be crossed over right now. But since you got murdered, you will be going to heaven. Okay? I'll be praying for you to go to heaven. The married couple, I'll be praying for y'all for you to go to heaven once judgment day comes. And again, what Joy said, you do not attach yourselves to our objects, vehicles, or our bodies. Do I make myself clear? I thought I heard a voice I just said make myself clear. If y'all heard a voice, let me know down in the comments section below as well. Alright, we're going to go to thank you again for the communication. Good to see you, Shadow. You guys can come around too. Hmm. So, God, everything. With the video like that, it takes the B roll footages. I knew tonight would be good. Yeah. But we're gonna go live. Um, about a front entrance. You okay? Mm -hmm. All right. All righty, so if we recall from the uh, reported hauntings, while I was doing some B-roll footages, I heard like rushings, like rushes, of water where there's no water around. I want to see if I could pick it up again. Can you make that sound of the rushing water? It was loud too. Of course, there's water right there, but it was like a rushing water sound, like a wave. But it's like when I was doing B roll footage, that's when I heard it. This place is active.
Cave goes on for miles. 136 acres. Um, Ooh, it's cold. It was not cold here before. Why is it jolly? So we got a change of temperature. It's cold right now. As you see on my leg here. Um, it's cold. See the chills. Change the temperature. Now it's when I heard the rushing water, like a residual. So I memorize where we went. You could easily get lost in here if you don't know where you're going. Yeah, we go from up here to the right. Yeah. Holy crap, this is so cold now. I'm here whispers, do you? Hello? Throw a rock for us, please. You hear that? Mm -hmm. Could be water tripping, but I don't think so. Coming from over here. And now uh, this is where I've seen eyeballs at too. I don't think it want us to leave at the moment. I believe it's water chirping. Where's the water? Is that part of what they're talking about? It's like the reported hauntings? See that st stuff on my phone is messing up. There's no puddles. So there's no water dripping. So for people on my channel, it's got the really cold in this area. Do what? I'm letting my people know about the guys in cold. I was like, I will uh, put my, all my clips together. Yeah. But I don't see no water dripping though. It's over there somewhere. But I still don't see it though. Please don't go there. I'm not. I said, want me to be safe. I know. That could be like a residual rushing water. And I did ask for her to do it again. Thank you. Can you stop making that noise? If you can. I heart I can't. I think I heard get out. Do you want us to get out? Could be paint. Yeah, I think I'll say paint. There's whisper behind you. Yeah, it's the same color as this. I heard a voice to the left while I was doing a B roll. I heard, please. Please leave. Are you saying please leave?
Oh, this is. is that a bat? No. Oh, yeah. Okay, you can put the light back down. You sure that's a bat? It probably is. No, I think that's a piece of wood. It almost looked like a bat at first. I know during the summer there'll be lots of bats. So we gotta go throughout this way. But it was not cold. Ow, it is. I'm starting to get shoulder pain now. But we definitely got our answers. That was a voice. Man, the voices are everywhere here. Oh man, those voices. I'm telling you, those voices, they're all over this cave. It's active, very active. I mean, like, it's mainly the female helping us get the answers we need. And we got them answers. We met a few other spirits too. That was just a wild story, a wild case. And the male, which is the son of the, the girlfriends, is still in jail. And the necrometer said jailhouse. So this is definitely a great investigation. And it's almost Halloween. Next week will be Halloween. So this will be perfect. I'm supposed to mine for Halloween.